the chain of survival. Identify patient. Call 911. Begin CPR. Use an AED. EMT arrives. You come across a person who is passed out on the floor. What do you do? Now is the time to approach, evaluate, defibrillate. Now is the time. Approach. Call 911 immediately. Carefully approach the patient, ensuring that the surrounding area is safe to do so. Are they laid in water? Are there any bare electrical wires nearby? How did they come to be on the ground? Is there a fallen ladder nearby, etc.? Never approach a patient who is in an environment that will also put you in danger. Evaluate. Quickly evaluate if this person needs assistance. Firstly, are they conscious or unconscious? If they are conscious, ask if they would like your help and then see if they can answer basic questions. What is your name? Where does it hurt? Calmly tell them to try and stay still. Keep them talking and conscious as you call 911. If they are unconscious, you can assume that they require assistance. Check to see if they are breathing. Is their airway blocked by vomit or an object? Can you feel a pulse? Can you feel breath from their nose or see their chest rising and falling? Defibrillate. Once you have established that the patient is not breathing, it is time to defibrillate. Begin CPR as soon as possible to get oxygenated blood moving around their body. If someone else is nearby, ask them to locate and bring the nearest automated external defibrillator. If you do not know of an AED nearby, continue CPR until EMT arrives. Once an AED has been located, use it immediately. Connect the device to the patient's bare chest. Use the razor kit included to ensure that hair is not preventing the pads from sticking. Allow the AED to analyze the patient and determine if a shock is needed. Follow the instructions from the AED and continue CPR as instructed until EMT arrives. Now is the time. It's time to learn more about AEDs and help save lives. Anyone can use an automated external defibrillator, AED. You do not require specialist training and there is no age restriction. If you are able to follow the verbal instructions provided by the device, the device will not administer a shock unless the patient analysis deems it necessary. You cannot cause any further harm by using an AED, but you can save a life. Now is the time.